You looking to win some ranked games as a support? Are you like all my friends and hate my favorite champion to play? All right, then you want Brand, baby, the hottest champion in League of Legends. He can poke laners, burst junglers, win lanes, and light your barbecue. He can do it all except spam laugh because he doesn't really have any fun movements, but whatever, let's just get this party fire started. Brand's like a bike. If you haven't played him in a while, well, it's really easy to just get started again. Look at those F blizzards. If you play him or support or mid, there are these runes that you want to take. This is the only champion where I actually say this. Scorch is actually pretty good here. Ugh. Still feels kind of disgusting to say, but let's just get into his abilities. Burning Man's passive is Blaze, but the ability in Blaze is a Blaze, so that's a thing. But this will just burn champions for a percent of their health after you spit hot fire about their mama. If they just recently got burned, then your next mama joke is going to have some extra effect in this. And if you hit them with a three-peat, they're going to explode. Your Q is EX Hadouken. Hadouken! If you don't get the joke, then maybe invest in some Street Fighter Six. All this does is throw a fireball at the enemy, and if they're already hot and bothered, then it forces them to stop, drop, and roll for 1.5 seconds. But after they do that, they're still on fire, so a lot of good that did them. But at least it gives you the chance to re an act of Wicker Man. Not the no, not that one. That's better. His W is burning ring of fire. The enemy goes down, 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 and your flames get higher. And it burns, burns, burns more if they're already ablaze. So make sure you get that combo with the next ability we're going to talk about for that extra Johnny Cash damage. His E is conflagration. His E is spontaneous combustion. <laughs> Because he randomly just set some shit on fire. This does spread to other enemies around the Tarje, and if they're still burning from your hot fire, the range of enemies affected is double. His R costs one generic mana and one mountain, and deals two damage to each creature. If you do get that joke, let me know in the comments. Now, the fireball bounces from enemy to enemy, but it also bounces off you, so you can pelvic thrust back at the enemy. It bounces four times, so it really can only hit one enemy twice, but that's okay. If they're already blazed, then it slows them for some reason. It doesn't really fit with brand, but okay, I guess I'll take it. Remember, it does prioritize hot targets, but you should probably cast it on a blaze once, too. <laughs> He's so funny. Oh, baby, that was beautiful. All right, now that we know his abilities, let's just get right into the gameplay. All right, we're in the game, and let's get this dagger and these mixed drinks, as even a fire being has to BYOB to this party. Burning man. All right, now that we're in lane, it's time to unleash your inner pyromaniac. Your abilities are all quite spammable, so you might as well just throw them at the enemy laners as much as possible. Hit them as many times as you can, as fast as you can. If the enemy laner has a big borrow boy engager, and either one of the enemy laners is low, then you've already won the lane, because he can't really try and engage with them that low, can he? If you're looking for maximum damage, you want to be sure to use your EQW combo. E to get the fire started, Q to make sure them stop, drop, and roll, and W so they burn, burn, burn in the ring of fire. Then they explode. Simple. They are playing back because they don't want any piece of this fire bat. I tend to try and use the W to poke them as much as you can. If you do hit a caster minion with your W, then they get this false sense of security because they think your ability's down. Then you just E that minion and hit them with that huge range poke damage. Just hit them as much as possible because if they're low, then they can't engage on you, so you win. Now that you're alt up, it's time for the real fun that they can't even get away from. If you do get the enemy low enough and there's a fresh wave coming down the lane, then you can actually just alt the wave and watch as the fire spreads to the back minions and eventually to the enemy running away. But but there ain't no running away from that. Oh, it's so satisfying. And once you do that, they all have to leave lane or they're dead. So either way works. Now, Bran doesn't crowds with her towers. He burns it down. Burn it down. Down to the ground. Now, once we get this tower, we probably have enough gold to go buy some items. And once we get back, we want to get the holy grail of burn damage. Double the burn equals double the fun. So now that we got this, we can leave the base and forget our oracles. That's fine, we don't got time for clearing Ward's enemy. There's shit to burn, and we are the fuel. Really, you should just get your oracles, though. Now it's time to get all the objectives and make sure you spread that forest fire. If Smokey the Bear comes to stop you, you burn him, too. And then bada bing, bada boom, we got more gold, so we want to get this item next so they can't run away. Since they can't run away, because we'll find them, we're going to burn them real good. Our ADC was kind of in lane, but we're really not sure how he's doing, but whatever. If he gets the kills, that's good enough. We don't care if they get any, they can get all the minions instead. Those big boys are ours, because we're the ones doing all the damage, and we're going to burn them till we're done. We will not stop until the fire reigns supreme! After that, you just want to pick up some more items for some more burning power. Then we're going to try and perform as much arson as possible. Burn the good Samaritans, burn down the towers, burn down the inhibitors, and then burn down the nexus. We want to see it go up in a fiery explosion. And if the enemy knows what's best for them, they'll give me a double explosion. And we did it! We won the game! If you enjoyed this video, check out Sonic Jin and he speeds across the rift. Talk to you later!